This is Oklahoma's own News 9. President Biden wants more than a trillion dollars invested in roads, railways, and broadband network over the next eight years. But how will this impact our state? Washington, D.C. Bureau Chief Alex Cameron spoke to our Secretary of Transportation and joins us with more. Well, Tim Gatz knows a thing or two about building roads and bridges. This is the seventh highway bill he's dealt with in his career. What's different about this one, it got rolled into the president's prized Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act. It's going to transform America to put us in a path to win the economic competition of the 21st century. Exactly how the new law will do that is still being explained to the people who will do the heavy lifting. And that's another reason we're up here right now is to get this policy briefing and, and uh, really begin to have a better understanding and a more clear understanding of what opportunities we might have. Oklahoma Secretary of Transportation Tim Gatz says the Biden administration's already announced that one focus will be on fixing structurally deficient bridges, an area where Oklahoma's gone from bottom 10 in the country to top 10. And apparently it's been noticed. We're extremely excited that they're kind of following Oklahoma's model, you know, and really putting a, an emphasis on taking care of our bridge infrastructure. Other details are still coming out, but Gatz knows that Oklahoma, which was already expecting to get about $4 billion in the regular highway bill, will now get more than $5 billion. As with every new highway bill, we'll be really uh, working through the policy guidance and, and gaining a clearer understanding, not just over the coming months, but over the coming years. Now, Gatz tells me on top of this, he's also going to be focused in the near future on increasing seatbelt usage in Oklahoma, which would lead to a reduction in highway fatalities, a statistic where Oklahoma is certainly not in the top 10, but the bottom 10. From our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.